Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of the Barclays Premier League. It's Leeds United against Leicester City. Here's your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Hello everybody, Martin Tyler is my name, Alan Smith is his name alongside me. And we're hoping to bring you some fine action from this game today. Here's a goal from White Hart Lane, Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Tottenham Hotspur. It's been scored by Hoon Min Son. The keeper was in no man's land at the corner and he was left with an open goal. Four minutes played, 1-0. Cheers, Alan. A chance for all to have a look at Leeds United. I think it's going to be a nervous old time for this team right through to the end because just hovering above that relegation zone. I'm not sure they're capable of climbing much higher. I think it's going to be a real tense season for them. There's some potential in this move. It's decent attacking play. Good skill with the ball to beat a man. And the defenders just managed to deal with that. And he strikes a goal! went up straight away, referee blue offside. Oh, in goes the cross. And the defender has coped well with that cross. <laughs> News of a goal from elsewhere, Alan McInally. It's a goal for Newcastle United. 20 minutes played, 1-0. Thanks, Alan. Got the cross in, which was important. The defender cut it out. Here he is with a chance. Oh, good reflexes by the goalkeeper. Powerful effort. Leeds United have got a corner now. But from a corner, they're going to have to do some defending now. Ease the pressure. The referee has acknowledged the flag from his assistant and given the offside. As for Leeds, this is a testing game, but I think it's one that they can pass that test and get the victory. Good defending. He's run a little better than that, trying to get in behind the defender. Liam Cooper. Keeper. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. And the ball knocked away long. It's a very crisp challenge there. Good forward play from them. Dangerous moment. Struck the post here. Well, that's a fantastic clearance. He rose to the occasion and saved the day. That could be an injury. An awkward challenge.
gone in strongly. So it's half time and we're still waiting for that first goal. They have had a catalogue of chances in this first half, but no goals. Well, they should. Everything set for the second half. Oh, what a vital stop. News of a goal from elsewhere, Alan McInally. It's the second goal for Newcastle United. 48 minutes played, 2-0. Cheers, Alan. And here we've got a free kick given by the referee. Into the attacking third. Takes the shot off. Hit with a volley here. to stop the game for the referee then and he's read the play well good control here quite congested midfield but good passing from this team from Stamford Bridge, Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Manchester City. It's been scored by Kevin De Bruyne. He won the aerial battle and guided home a header. 57 minutes played, 1-0. Thank you very much, Alan. Gets his foot in there. You can see what he was trying to do, just stretch the opposition by getting the ball out wide, but it's gone out for a throw. Fantastic slide tackle to get the ball. If he wants to go to the right, that's where the options are. News of a goal from elsewhere, Alan McInally. It's a goal for Brighton and Hove Albion. 66 minutes played, 2-1. Thanks, Alan. Oh, they've still got an opportunity here after the goalkeeper parried it. That's a fine tackle. Looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. Well, there's nothing still to separate these teams, despite these chances. Well, we're... Still level here, and we're going to have a substitution. Is this the way to alter the match in their favour? Three changes, all at the same time. It's quite a drastic decision from the manager. The whistle is gone because the assistant flag for offside. Liam Cooper. of a goal from elsewhere, Alan McInally. It's a third goal for Newcastle United. 79 minutes played, 3-1. Cheers, Alan. Been a terrific contest this match, and it could have a fantastic end to it as well. So close. Good position, they've worked this attack very well. Into a quite a dangerous position now.
they've been uh, thwarted here. That's a sign of better things to come. Challenged quickly by the opposition. Goal news from White Hart Lane, Alan McAnally. It's the second goal for Tottenham Hotspur. It's been scored by Hoon Min Son. Amazing little run past the defenders, followed by a powerful strike past the keeper. One minute remaining, 2-0. Thank you very much, Alan. He takes the shot. They've been relying on the goalkeeper a lot today and again here late on. Yeah, really good save. I think the rest of his team thought that the opposition had scored that. Well, he has been in majestic form today. His positioning for me has been the major factor. He's been flawless. From a corner. Oh! It's been a succession of saves, Alan, from both goalkeepers. Great thing as well, Martin. They've moved the feet quickly. Not only have they used their hands well, stopped them with the feet. Great stuff. were jangling then that defensive player it's looking good this move goes for goal oh and goes across oh so close off the bar well done the defenders a good organization there in the face of a promising move it's one back Goalless. Mm -hmm. this game, Alan. They dominated the ball. They didn't take it into a winning position. I think they were always positive in possession, though, Martin. They didn't try those incisive one touch passes quite enough. So it's finished scoreless. I have to say it was a bit disappointing. We all had higher hopes than that. I'll leave you with the full match highlights. And until next time, I've been Jeff Stelling.